hello children welcome to class 6 today we will start the first chapter of science food where does it come from this is a very interesting chapter related to our day to day life we all eat different kinds of food at different times. What is your favorite food? Now just imagine, can you eat your favorite food every day and every time? That means, can you eat your favorite food in breakfast? lunch and dinner every day no we can't do that we need variety in food okay now tell me why do we need food yes we need food because it provide energy to us it is Helpful to do all kind of day-to-day -day activities we do. You must be aware about different uses of food. Now, come to the first topic of this chapter that is food variety. We will do this very interesting activity, activity 1. In this activity, we will try to find out that what food items we eat in a day. For example, a, a table is given here. Here I will write the name of any one of you. For example, Tanishka. What food item eaten in a day like uh, boiled rice, dal, vegetable, curry. In this way, you prepare a table and try to find out that what food items you eat in a day. Don't go to your friend, friend's home to ask that what he or she has eaten today. What you will do? You will just give a call to your best friend and ask him or her to tell that what food items he or she eats in a day. After doing this activity, you will come to know that we eat variety of food items in a day. Now, have you ever had a thought that what are these food items made up of? These food items are made up of different ingredients or materials we used to call it ingredients you must have heard it that your mom says that we need raw rice to prepare boiled rice there are some items which are made up of only two ingredients but many food items are made up of many ingredients to prepare vegetable curry vegetable curry means the vegetable which we eat vegetable curry we need different kinds of vegetables salt spices oil etc after doing this activity one we will come to know that 
there are so many types of foods there is a variety in food which we eat every day now we will do one more activity activity 2 in this activity we will choose some food items and try to find out the ingredients ingredients present in that food item for example roti or chapati is made by atta and water next dal dal is prepared by pulses water salt oil or ghee and spices what is your favorite pulses okay i like moong dal most dear children you have to prepare a table in which write at least 10 food items and their ingredients after doing this activity we will come to know that so many type of ingredients are there and with the help of a single ingredients we can prepare different variety of foods like with the help of rice we can prepare different type of food items can you give me the name of the food items prepared by rice the very next question which cross to our mind is that what are the sources of these food materials you can very easily find out the sources of some food materials like fruits and vegetable from where they obtained yes of course from plants what are the sources of rice and wheat yes they are also obtained from plants there are food items like milk egg and meat which come from animals now come to the activity 3 yes in this activity we will prepare a table in which we will write the different sources of ingredients in this table in column 1 we will take the name of food item then its ingredients then its sources can you tell me the sources of urad dal yes plant salt there may be many sources of salt here i am writing c water water again there are so many sources of water you can write it here can you tell me the source of spices children very good very interesting one from where we get the sugar yes now what you have to do prepare a table write at least 10 food items and their ingredients and sources of those ingredients after doing this activity you will come to know that 
different food items are obtained by different parts of a plant we will discuss it further that which plant part produce which ingredient of a food item look at this diagram different edible parts of a plant isn't it beautiful children have you noticed a plant ever yes very good in a plant we have root system in root system there is a main root which is known as primary root some roots are coming out from this primary root and are known as secondary root this part that means root system is present underground have you noticed any plant which have the roots in air try to find out okay now this part of plant is present above the ground which mainly contain leaf stem and fruits and flower i repeat it leaf stem fruits flower you may observe some birds or bud birds also i will tell you about node and internode separately so the whole plant can be divided into two parts root system and shoot system root system contain primary root and secondary root this aerial part aerial part means the part which present above the ground contain bud leaf stem fruit and flower now it is very interesting to know that which part of a plant is edible do you have any idea of that okay here we will write different plant part which are used as a food example food item with plant as a major source ingredient or sources plant part which gives us the ingredient the first one brinjal curry which is prepared by brinjal chili oil brinjal is a fruit chili is also a fruit oil obtained from seeds just like that we will prepare a table of different food items ingredients of that food item and then we will write that plant part which gives us that ingredients a one more very interesting activity is given here
that is how we can obtain sprouts how many of you eat sprouts in your breakfast we will do this activity in our le next lesson